Okay, in this video we're going to talk about how to form the proper mantis claw. So if we have both of your hands here, let's just kind of put them side by side, or parallel here. And so what we want to do is start bringing our fingers down towards the palm. And the last two digits, the thumb and the pointer finger, we're going to just connect the thumb right here to this middle part of your finger, the middle digit, well the middle part of your, your pointer digit, okay? So Mantis always has this curvature regarding how it holds its posture. If you look at a praying mantis, you'll see that the, the little pointers are pointed down and there's a curvature around the wrist. Okay, so when you form the proper mantis claws, the easiest way to do that is just to bring the fingers into the palm. I'll show you here this way. Bring the fingers in towards the palm and connect the thumb right here to this middle part of the pointer digit, okay? And that's the mantis claw, very, very simple. And so when we start forming the mantis claw and forms, it uh, becomes very quick, just go right there. We use these three fingers here in order to grapple, in order to grab and make sure that we have a strong hold. Mantis has a lot of grabs. And so when the mantis grabs, it'll use these three fingers along with the palm and the pointer and the thumb are still connected. It'll grab like that. Just kind of show you from the, the other side position as well. Here, like such. Okay? So that's how the mantis will grab. That's the mantis claw on how it grapples. We'll, we'll continue more about grappling with the mantis. But these three fingers here, along with the palm, are also used to control your person's or your opponent's arm once you lock it. Okay? That's the mantis grab.